In today's video, we're gonna be talking about how easy it is to set up your own XLR microphone for your streams, and we're gonna be shooting it a little bit different. Hey guys, what's up, it's Bravity, and welcome back to another video here on my channel. Hope you guys are having a fantastic day. So like I said in the intro, we're gonna be talking about XLR microphones and how simple they can be to set up for your YouTube videos or for your stream. A lot of people have been asking me to do this video because they think it's terrifying and scary to set up an XLR mic compared to like a USB microphone, and that is not true at all. Yes, a USB microphone just plugs into the back of the PC, but an XLR mic can almost be as simple as that. I'm just gonna show you two things that you need to get an XLR mic set up into your stream it is unbelievably simple almost as easy as just plugging usb into the back of your pc just like you would with a usb microphone and like i said in the intro we're going to be doing it in a bit of a different way so this here is the black magic pocket cinema camera 4k in uh, layman's terms it's a camera it's just another camera if you want to see me unbox this and talk about this camera i'll put a little card up in the corner of the video you can watch that but we're going to be using this to show you guys what is going on on my setup because i figured the best way to show you how to set up an xlr microphone is just to show you the setup I'm running. It is unbelievably simple to get high quality audio. And instead of just cutting away and showing B-roll and whatnot, I'm just going to talk to you just like a normal video, just no cuts or anything, just going to talk to you. And I'm going to show you exactly what I'm seeing with this camera as I sit here. I think that is the best way to show you guys how to set up an XLR microphone. So let's go ahead and get right into it. So to get started, we're actually just going to talk about what an XLR mic even is. A lot of you might've been just sitting there in the intro thinking, what are these letters that you're saying? I have no idea what we're talking about. So an XLR mic, is just a higher end professional microphone compared to like a USB microphone. A USB microphone is kind of like a webcam. It's just kind of an intro starter camera for people who want to start streaming. And then an XLR mic is like a real camera or a DSLR. It's a high end, more professional piece of equipment that takes a little bit more to get used to and to set up, but it's so worth it. It sounds fantastic. I highly recommend upgrading to an XLR mic when you can, when you can afford it. It'll really up the quality of your stream. But an XLR is just an audio cable. So the reason it's called an XLR mic is because it uses a cable that looks like that. That is an XLR cable. You can see it's just three prongs. This is the male and the female end. The female end plugs into your microphone and then the male end runs off into another piece of equipment. Now you may be noticing with a USB mic, you can just take that USB, plug it into your PC and you're done. But a, uh, Last time I checked, a PC doesn't have an XLR cable, and that is where your interface comes in. The two pieces of kit that I mentioned that you need in the beginning is a microphone and an interface. I'm gonna give you my recommendations for both of those at the end of the video, but now we're gonna be talking about what an interface even is. So let's take a look at it through this camera here. So as you can see, the XLR cable is right there plugged into my microphone, and it runs up the arm right here, whoop, just like that. And then you can see it in the back there, just right there running across my desk, and it runs all the way behind into this right here. This is an interface. So I'll leave this camera pointed at the interface while we are talking about it. So this is what an interface looks like. It is just a little box with a bunch of knobs and plugs on it. So what it is, is it pretty much allows you to take an XLR mic and convert it into a USB signal to run into your PC. And then it gives you a bunch of these hardware knobs that you can adjust the mic gain. You can adjust your headphone volume. You can adjust the volume that goes into speakers, all kinds of stuff. It really just gives you hardware knobs to adjust all that. But on the left side there, you can see a blue cable running into the interface. That is the XLR from this microphone and you can see as I talk that blue or that green light lights up that is the knob for the mic gain and then the cable on the right side that is just my headphones running out your headphones will run out of your interface if you are using one but now let's take a look at the back of the interface so this is the back of the interface. As you can see, there's just a couple more plugs, not much going on. On the left, there is a plug that is literally just a USB cable running out into my computer. And then on the right side, there are some speaker cables that are just running out to my speakers. So an interface really just allows you to take a normal XLR cable and just plug it in. And then out the back, you get a USB cable like this that just terminates to like a normal USB that would plug in. And that's all it is. An interface is honestly, the best way to think about it is just a massive adapter. So you're taking an XLR cable, plugging it in, in and then plugging a USB into the back and the USB runs into your computer. And from there, you can treat it honestly just like a USB microphone. So you plug the USB into the back of your PC and your PC is just gonna recognize your interface. So this is a Focusrite interface and I highly recommend them. So on my PC, I'm just gonna set all my input devices and all my output devices to my Focusrite interface. And that is all I need to do. It's the input device because the mic is running into the interface and it's the output device because my speakers are running out of it and my headphones are running out of it. And that is is all you need to set up an XLR mic. You've just got the XLR 
running into the interface and then the interface running into your PC. There's one added piece of kit from a USB mic. So a USB mic just comes from the microphone and plugs into the computer using a USB. This plugs into an interface and then into the computer using a USB. Yes, there are much more advanced ways that you can set up an XLR mic. You can run them through mixers. You can run them through a Go XLR. There's all kinds of stuff that you can do, but this is by far the most simple way to set up an XLR microphone. And that is it guys. So I hope this convinced you guys that you can actually set up an XLR mic if you want to. So many people People just stick to USB microphones because they're terrified of how hard it is to set up an XLR mic. But there you can see my setup for making these YouTube videos for Twitch streams. It's just this into an interface and into my PC and then my input and output devices are the interface. So I told you guys that I'd recommend some stuff in this video. I do want to recommend the Focusrite Scarlett 2i2 interface. It is the interface that I've been using for years and it is fantastic and I'll put the link down into the description. Microphones are a little bit harder to recommend because price ranges can vary so much, but I'm going to put three microphones that I highly recommend if you're looking for an XLR mic to work with this interface. And then you just need cables. You can have some XLR cables sometimes interfaces or microphones will come with XLR cables and then if you really wanted to you can have one of these arms but you might already have one for your USB mic anyway but it is super simple to set this up and I hope you guys enjoyed the video if you guys like these videos where I just kind of show you how my setup works where I use a different camera maybe we can go in more more into depth with some other kinds of videos talking about how to set up cameras talking about how to set up lighting that kind of stuff where we take a camera and we talk while we show you with the camera let me know down in the comments but I will see you guys in the next video